Welcome to Business Reports. To ensure the sustainability of domestic refining and energy security, Nigeria must strengthen its regulatory frameworks. President of the Lagos, or Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Gabriel Idahosa, said this at the 2024 annual conference of the Petroleum Downstream Group. Details in this report. The journey towards enhancing domestic refining and achieving energy security in Nigeria is both a challenge and an opportunity, as the impact of the refining deficit is profound, affecting everything from fuel prices to inflation and economic stability. This conference focuses on enhancing domestic refining and energy security, exploring the impact and way forward. Speakers argue that with the right policies, infrastructure investment, and a commitment to sustainable energy, Nigeria could reduce its reliance on fuel imports, stabilize petroleum prices, and secure its energy future. So our concern in the business community is that these regulations should be targeted at the expected results. If you want private sector to invest significantly at any stage in the oil and gas industry, the, the regulations should be transparent in the sense that if I'm investing, I should understand that these are the laws and if I comply with them, I can operate. Without lamentation, now that I've seen that totally, they are totally regulated the industry in the sense that no more sold off taker by an NPC from Dangote Refinery. So people can now go directly, marketer can go directly to a Dangote Refinery, bargain with them and buy at their own rate. Or you can also import your own product and then you said as you buy. So that's where we are now. The NNPCL estimates that Nigeria loses around 200,000 barrels of oil per day to theft and sabotage, disrupting both crude export and domestic refinery operations. As industry experts explore downstream opportunities, they urge the government to bolster oil infrastructure security through enhanced policing, technology-based surveillance, and community collaboration. Uh, this synthesis, synthesis gas is where ammonia uh, which comes from. From technical perspective, ammonia from ammonia and uh, is not necessarily a chemical in direct sense, but because they are produced from steam gas, the PIA, there was no mainstream at all. It was non existent. Yet we acknowledge, as the second speaker said, that the mainstream is where you have the highest growth potentials. Whether in terms of revenue, products, outputs, um, employment opportunities, it's the reach. While the LCCI views the Petroleum Industry Act as a positive step, they assess that more action is required to equip regulatory bodies with the necessary capacity to effectively monitor compliance, prevent product hoarding, and regulate pricing. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.